wife and mother lost at sea. Her husband now charged with her murder. News Channel 5's Michelle Casada live in Miami, where Lewis Bennett went before a federal judge. Michelle. Michael, Lewis Bennett is serving seven months in prison for transporting stolen coins found in the life raft he used to escape his sinking boat. It's unclear if evidence in that case will be used to try to prove he sank the boat and killed his wife, but a maritime expert I spoke with believes the FBI has plenty of evidence. We do not know if these pictures and videos of the boat Lewis Bennett and his wife Isabella Hellman were traveling in are the only evidence the FBI has in her disappearance. But maritime lawyer Joanne Foster believes it's enough to try to prove Bennett scuttled his catamaran while at sea last May. When people intentionally scuttle a boat, they leave a lot of evidence behind. The FBI determined two holes in the hull of the boat were made from the inside. The holes were too neat. There's no scraping around. The holes. You don't see anything leading up to that puncture and you don't see anything trailing from it. Foster noted in order to make Bennett's story that the boat hit something plausible, you would see some scraping leading up to the holes. Foster has several years experience with insurance defense and says the holes, the escape hatches found open beneath the waterline of the boat and the laundry list of items including 14 gallons of water and the alleged stolen silver coins Bennett had time to place into a life raft do not point to an accidental sinking. Once you open the the hatch you pretty much have declared your intentions and prevented the boat from from being saved. The FBI says Bennett admitted he never looked for the source of flooding or tried to save the boat. Reporting live in Miami, Michelle Casada, WPTV.